we have given functions and we have to first draw the graphs of these functions to find the area. So let's draw x, y plane. First function, we have exponential function e to power x. We know that the graph of exponential function is in the first and in the second quadrant. For x equals 0, we have value e to 0 power is 1. Next, we have e, let's put x equals 1. e to power 1 will be 2 something so approximately let's put this point here our graph looks like this it's going to positive infinity this is our y function e to power x next we have y equals zero so this is our x-axis this is y equals 0. Next, we have x equals 0. x equals 0 is our y-axis. This is x equals 0. And we have x equals 3. 2, 3. This is our fourth function. x equals 3. This is our y equals e to power x. We got area between these four curves. This is our area which we need to calculate. We see that this area is between 0 and 3. Our function is continuous, so we will use formula that area is equal integral from 0 to 3, definite integral, and our function is e to power x. So we have integral with respect to x. Integral of e to power x is e to power x, and we have limits of integration from 0 to 3. So first we have to plug upper limit. So we have e to power 3 minus e to power 0. So this is equal. We can use calculator. e to power 3 is equal 20.08. And we have e to power 0 is 1. So we have minus 1. So this is equal 19.08. So this is our area of course square units.